friends, Christmas is round the corner and so are the festivities. It is that time of the year when everybody wants to be the secret center for somebody or the other. This episode of Prerna Kisro gives you that opportunity to be the secret center for somebody, not just one, but many people. Feed the Souls has been doing this job relentlessly for the last couple of years now, and Payal Kumar is the proud owner of this brand. So let's welcome Payal to the show, and let's understand from her what all she does as part of the Feed the Soul community. So welcome to Prerna Kisro, uh, Payal. Thank you. such a pleasure to have you here since i've watched all your videos and the pictures that you've posted on instagram about those small kids and how the distribution of food and things that you're doing so um tell us about feed the souls how did this idea come to your mind um shivali you know food is a very important part of who i am and so is cooking uh, i basically come from a family where everybody cooks and for us you know uh, andan has been a part of our growing up we've seen our elders doing it from very beginning so in fact it was like a mandate which we all followed but when you are faced with a situation a testing time you realize that you know you have to put your passion and your resources at use that is when uh, i started feed the souls i used to cook earlier also but it was Like you know, I used to cook in small batches for small number of people on specific days. I used to do the distribution, but with onset of COVID, we realized that the uh, amount of food required was huge. So we thought we would, you know, formally start something where people would connect and we would be able to cover more and more people. So that is why Feed the Souls came into being. Uh, so Payal, currently uh, you're working uh, in Delhi and CR that territory. Right? Correct, correct. So yes. What are these people that you're supporting? What is their uh, background and where do they come from? Uh, see, uh, because our mainstay is food, and food is one thing you can't say no to anybody. वो तो ऐसे लगता है ना कि जो भी भूखा है या जो भी आपके सामने आप किसी को मना नहीं कर सकते. So our main uh, cover area is uh, slums. there are two main clusters that i cover and beyond that we cover people who stay under the flyovers who are outside mandirs we also do lepers colony and places where i can't reach jahan pe mujhe lagta hai ki aur khane ki zarurat hai but hum log individually nahi pahunch sakte we have collaborated with robin hood army unke areas jahan pe wo cover karte hain fir unke sath hum collaborate karke khana bhejte hain so um any is any particular story that you would like to share with us see what i have already uh, informed the viewers that uh, you are ensuring that uh, you know no stomach is unfed whatever that you come across people are fed you are also donating clothes uh, with people who are supporting you in their in this cause um, so tell us any particular story that you know you can think of right now which is which really um, touched you and how did the entire process uh, went on uh, shivali for me uh, birthdays are very important like you know i i love birthdays even at this age one week advance i get excited that okay birthday is coming so uh, when i started going to these slums i realized that majority of children don't even know when their birthdays are and they have never celebrated one so we started with a project called project utsav in which we pledge to celebrate birthdays of these slum children there is no specific date we just pick up a date and we take cakes and you know one child will be called out of the whole lot and they would cut the cake and it's like a day of celebration for them so during one of the celebrations there is this one small girl she comes to me and she tells me aunty mera birthday kab karoge to maine aise usko bola mere ka theek hai simran aapka birthday na saturday ko karenge hum so i went on saturday apna cake leke we take pot, uh, these party poppers and caps and everything for them so i went and i said theek hai simran ko bhejo uska birthday hai aaj so this small tiny girl she comes from one end she looks at me and she runs back maine kaha pata nahi kya baat hai bhai aaj to birthday hai so she should come instantly table lay ho gaya sab kuch ho gaya and simran is nowhere to be seen 5 minutes 10 minutes 15 minutes and this girl is not coming so then suddenly i realized after like good 20 25 minutes of waiting for simran to come and celebrate her birthday she is coming from one end and she is dressed in a beautiful two size bigger than her size lehenga 
प्रॉपर वो ग्लिटर वाला लहंगा पहन के बड़ा होगा कहीं से उसको मिला होगा वो लहंगा पहन के आई है एंड शी टोल्ड मी वेरी यू नो वेरी स्वीटली शी टेल्स मी मेरा बर्थडे है ना मैं तैयार होने गई थी नेचुरली यू नो दैट टच मी सो मच आई फेल्ड यू नो मतलब हमारे लिए बहुत नॉर्मल है बर्थडे पे केक काटना बट उन बच्चों के लिए जिन्होंने कभी ये चीज करी ही नहीं है उनके लिए केक काटना वो सच अ बिग थिंग दैट इमेजिन शी डिट केयर कि मेरे लिए पूरे लोग खड़े और मतलब आराम से चेंज करके आई है और अपना दिन शी केम एंड शी गॉट हर बर्थडे सेलिब्रेटेड हर डे एंड शी सेलिब्रेटेड ओह यस ओह यस एंड यू नो आई कैन नेवर फॉरगेट द स्माइल ऑन हर फेस एंड आफ्टर दैट वी प्लेड आई सेड एवरी वीक 10 डेज व्हेनेवर वी आर एबल टू डू वी विल सेलिब्रेट देयर बर्थडेस वी स्टॉप्ड राइटिंग नेम्स यू नो इनिशियली पीपल यूज्ड टू टेल अस कि ठीक है हमारा बर्थडे है हम चाहते हैं आप इनको केक खिला दो तो जिसका बर्थडे होता था तो वी यूज्ड टू राइट देयर नेम्स Once I celebrated Simran's birthday, I stopped writing anybody's name because I wanted it to be their day, not anybody else's day. Mm-hmm. And randomly, I pick up people. Like, बच्चे जितने खड़े हैं ना उसमें से कोई भी चार पांच बच्चों को बुला के उनका बर्थडे हम इस प्रोजेक्ट उत्सव में करवाते हैं. And it's really joyful to see them cutting that cake and the way you know they get that excitement. कि हम स्पेशल हैं. वो पूरे उनको लॉट में से निकाल के जब आप खड़ा करते हो ना एक कोने पे केक काटने के लिए. it's that's a I different see, feeling i think some of these pictures and they really melt your heart some of these yeah, very very really sweet the very sweet yeah correct correct yeah beautiful so how do you manage all of this because it requires a lot of infrastructure procuring of material and oh. it's not always possible to you know be able to do it on your own so how do you manage that uh, see um, when i initially started i was cooking and everything was happening but when we started covering more and more people i started getting girls from the slums who were wanting to come and cook with us jaise aap jaate ho i personally go for all distributions i don't send the i don't just make the food and send it across i personally go and see where the food is being distributed each and every meal to waha jao to fir waha pe jo ladkiyan interested hain खुद आगे से कुछ लोग आते हैं और आपको बोलते हैं कि हमें आप खाना बनाना सिखा दोगे या हम आपके पास आके काम कर सकते हैं तो अब आज की डेट में मेरे पास पांच छह लड़कियां हैं जो इन्हीं क्लस्टर्स में से हैं जो मेरे साथ आकर के खाना बनाना अब सीख रहे हैं मतलब बेसिक काम तो उनको आता है बट मुझे ऐसे लगता है कि वंस दे गेट ट्रेन इन प्रॉपर कुकिंग दे विल बी बेटर ऑफ यू नो फ्रॉम वेर एवर दे आर तो खाना बनाने में तो यही लड़कियां मैंने अब अपने साथ में जोड़ ली है जिससे कि उनकी भी मदद हो रही है मेरी भी मदद हो रही है और प्रोक्योरमेंट के अंदर यस इट इज अ टास्क इट इज लॉट ऑफ वर्क दैट इज इन्वॉल्व बट थैंकफुली आई हैव लॉट ऑफ पीपल हु आर कनेक्टिंग विद मी जो जैसे अब हम सेवा किचन कर रहे हैं सेवा किचन इज वंस अ मंथ आई ओपन द डोर्स ऑफ माय हाउस एनीबडी एंड एवरीबडी इज वेलकम टू कम एंड सी कि क्या हम करते हैं कैसे करते हैं आओ हमारे साथ खाना बनाओ met and i it will be more than happy people want to come with us for distribution also saath chalo at least come and experience the whole thing because you know once you experience then only you will understand how important it is to be there not to judge just be there and see what difference you can make in their lives each meal makes a difference to to tell you um, see what my experience is हमारे लिए तो एक मील का कोई फर्क नहीं पड़ेगा मतलब हमें लगेगा क्या है आपने एक आलू पूरी खिला दिया या एक बर्गर दे दिया पास्ता दे दिया शायद आपके लिए कोई बड़ी बात नहीं हो बट फॉर समबडी दैट माइट बी द ओनली मील ओनली गुड नाइस यम मील दैट दे वुड हैव फुल डे आप पूरा दिन पता नहीं उनको कुछ खाने के लिए मिला है नहीं मिला एक मील से उनका पूरा दिन बन सकता है मतलब यू नो इट मेक्स अज डिफरेंस in not only filling up their stomach giving them a good sleep but overall also you know i meet so many children every day these children they don't go to school they are always at home they are babysitting their siblings matlab kitni bari hota hai ki inke mama papa subah subah chale gaye kyunki kisi construction site pe hai ya kahin hai and they don't even have time to you know plan ki ab hamari tarah nahi hai na hum office ja rahe hain ji wo maid aayegi un khana banayenge ya tumhe pata hai bachcho ne kya khana hai these children don't even know what they're going to have for breakfast lunch or dinner there are there are no fixed meals for them so when i go so many times i have realized that small children are left alone at home there is nobody to look for them 
और उनके लिए तो वो वन मील मीन्स अ लॉट ना फॉर देम इट इज मतलब उनके लिए तो बहुत बड़ी चीज है कि उनको एक गरम गरम कोई घर से बना साफ सुथरा खाना मिल जाए दे इज नो बडी लुकिंग फॉर देम तो इट रियली मीन्स अ लॉट so you mentioned about seva kitchen now tell us more about seva kitchen fire what is seva kitchen and can i also come some day go oh, i would love to have you why not sure you know seva kitchen the whole idea behind seva kitchen was um people have to understand connect and that is only when they will be able to for a long term be uh, acceptable of the fact that you have to be considerate of lot of things सेवा किचन में हम अपने घर का दरवाजा खोल देते हैं जिसने आना आओ आके हमारे साथ में मील्स बनाओ यू डू द कटिंग यू डू द चॉपिंग यू आर इन्वॉल्व इन होल प्रोसेस एंड वंस द फूड इज कुक द फूड इज पैक्ड एंड देन वी गो टू द क्लस्टर्स दैट वी आर रेगुलरली कवरिंग एंड डिस्ट्रीब्यूट द फूड सो यू आर इन्वॉल्व नॉट ओनली फ्रॉम कटिंग चॉपिंग बट टू द टाइम द फूड इज एक्चुअली इटन बाय समबडी तो पूरा प्रोसेस देखो उसके अंदर आओ यू नो इट्स अ वाइब You have to be there to absorb it and खुद आओ अपने ब्लेसिंग आपको भी मिलेंगे प्लेस वेर आई स्टे वी हैव स्मॉल स्मॉल चिल्ड्रेन एंड यू नो आई जस्ट इट वॉज जस्ट अ थॉट आई सेट ओके दिस मंथ लेट एस डू सेवा किचन एवरी वीक and for one week i wanted to do it with little children so i had just put it in my colony group that in case younger children would be interested in doing a cooking event i got such sweet response you know all children under 12 connected there were 14 children and when i planned i thought they'll make 100 sandwiches and thak jayenge isse zyada to inka interest nahi hoga you won't imagine after 100 sandwiches aunty bread aunty kheera aunty ye करते करते आई रियलाइज इन दी एंड दे मेड टू हंड्रेड एटी एट सैंडविचेज द सैंडविचेज मर मेड बाई दीज चिल्ड्रन दे वर पैक्ड बाई दैम एंड देन वी फाइनली मेन्ट एंड डिस्ट्रीब्यूटेड इन द क्लस्टर एंड वेन वी वर यू नो फिनिशिंग ऑफ द इवेंट आई गेव ईच वन ऑफ दैम अ पिक्चर बिकॉज आई वॉन्टेड दैम टू नो वे दीज सैंडविचेज आर गोइंग सो ईच पिक्चर हैड दीज चिल्ड्रन हु आर फ्रॉम द स्लम्स एंड one or the other meal they are holding so behind the picture i wrote that you know you have made sandwiches for them you volunteered and thank you for it so they kept looking at the pictures the young kids yeah 7 8 9 years acha aunty humne inke liye banaya hai ye ye khayenge mera sandwich ye khane wale hai so you know it was one way of teaching younger lot what empathy is all about these children are really missing it they know how to give party to their friends how to do a birthday party but to cook for somebody who you don't know and who can't afford this meal for these children for the slum children even a basic kheera tomato myoni sandwich is like a treat so i told them i said theek hai inke liye surprise ke liye na isme do do toffees rakh ke aap pack karo the excitement level went to another high you know wo do do toffees aunty main teen rakh sakta hu main ye kar sakta hu once you show them what it is all about then it's a very different uh, and it was very well accepted very well accepted i think i think you you mentioned uh, certain points which are the kind of music to my ears and what i always <laughs> you know tell during my workshop to parents is the kind of values that these small things you know these selfless mm-hmm. acts they instill in the kids which uh, somewhere you know uh, are kind of missing in current uh, scenario that we find amongst kids so uh, what are the plans you mentioned the project utsav and something which is coming up uh, project utsav is uh, where we are celebrating birthdays of these children seva kitchen is there also what we have now started shivali um, you know when you go personally to these slums when you visit them then you realize there is lot of work that needs to be done every time i used to go for meal distribution i used to realize that these children are doing nothing so basically they're just loitering left right center they don't go to school there's there's a fixed time so the water tanker from where they have to fill water is going to come at one specific time this time they're going to do this so majority of the time they're khali they have nothing to do they're loitering around so 
I plan to do activity classes with them. I am not planning to tutor them. There, it is not school. My only plan is to make them sit. Saturday, Sunday, we do these activity classes where these children have a nice, comfortable time. Ao, date do ghanta betho. Be, मतलब coloring करो, थोड़ा बहुत craft activity करो, singing, dancing, so that at least there is something constructive happening in their life. Slowly, slowly, I might be able to convince the parents कि at least अगर आपके पास दो बच्चे हैं, तीन बच्चे, एक को school डालो, दो को school डालो, आपको घर चलाने के लिए सारे बच्चे घर पे नहीं चाहिए. तो my plan on a longer basis is to put them in proper schools. But till that time, these activity classes will happen and aim is to give them some constructive time to make them sit, to make them understand that there's much more to life, much more to time that you have. Instead of khali aise ghoomne mein to koi end nahi hai na. And you know, these children are very happily coming for the classes. Not that ki matlab aunty aayegi, khana degi aur chale jayegi. Unko pata hai ki class hai. Hum storytelling sessions karte hai and it is all volunteer based. There is no appointed teacher for them. So I always put that, okay, this Saturday, Sunday, if somebody wants to come and spend time with them, come read a story to them, come help them coloring. So that at least, you know, it's a two-way thing. It's easy to judge, but when you come on the ground and you see their life, things are way different. See, one, it, it keeps you grounded. The entire experience of, you know, interacting with the kids, it keeps you grounded. Two, it teaches you such, you know, fabulous values uh, that probably we are not able to teach at home these days. And uh, see, the kind of work that you mentioned, Payal, uh, whether it is uh, Seva Kitchen or Project Utsa, where you celebrate birthdays, or this uh, weekend classes kind of, I would say personality development, but in a way also there's so much talent amongst these kids, which, you know, just goes wasted. And uh, the kind of um, the kind of habits that they pick up uh, because they're not doing anything constructive, nothing creative. Correct, happening. correct, yes. So uh, what you're trying to do, it will keep them away from all those, uh, you know, kind mm. of habits that they might get into. Um, so but how do you get the kind of uh, support because you would need a lot of support for all these uh, things so how do you get uh, do you need you know some support from the community or if you want to give a message to the people uh, who will be watching um, this uh, please go ahead see um, I have been very very lucky you know what happened when I started I never realized that we are going to cover so many people so it was just when we were young, our parents always told us, okay, you do charity, you do it from your right hand and your left should not come to know about it. But then I realized that if you want to cover more and more people, if you want to grow, if you want to involve more and more people, you have to come out and come out loud and clear. So there is no harm. So for me, the only message I want to give is, one, please don't judge. B, be acceptable. C, be considerate. Look around. It is not important that you have to connect with us for our cluster children. There are a lot of children, a lot of places around you, wherever we stay, everywhere there is a requirement. Please be considerate, be sensitive about the people around you. For us, I am open to everything. If you want to come with us, come with us. If you want to come cook with us, I'm happily you know, welcoming everybody to come and experience the theme. And um, whatever way you want to connect with us, we are happily uh, open for everything. Wonderful. That's such a lovely message. And on this note, I would like to, you know, make an appeal to all the people who are watching this this uh, particular episode of Prerna Kids Both, that please go ahead. This is the time when you want to spread the joy of giving, sharing, uh, be there as, as a centre for somebody. Here is Payal who is working like a secret centre for so many people for last couple of years. And I wish you a lot of luck for all the future Thank projects you. and all the endeavours with uh, Feed the Souls and with Payal. So a lot of lot of luck and success to you, a lot of happiness Thank and, and tons of blessings to this beautiful project of yours. Thank you so much for coming to pray. Thank you. Podcast. Thank you, Shivati. And wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Same to you, same to you. Happy New Year.